I'm Heather, CEO of Handy. I want you to imagine for a moment if your human right to sexual pleasure was taken away and you're no longer able to self-pleasure, relying on others or going without. This is Andrew, my disabled brother and co-founder, and he doesn't have to imagine it because this is his reality. Hi there, I'm Andrew Gerza, Chief Disability Officer at Handy and a disabled man. Due to the way my hands work as a result of disability, I've lost the ability to self-pleasure. This has been a huge loss for me. It feels like I lost a sense of my manhood and my masculinity, and to be honest, that sucks. Unfortunately, none of the current sex toys on the market have considered the needs of people with hand limitations, which leaves us frustrated and unable to tap into a core part of our humanity. At Handy, we believe in everybody's human right to sexual pleasure. And that's why we're creating the first line of sex toys that don't rely on the use of your hands. Introducing the Handy Joystick. We've worked with sexual health and design experts, occupational therapists, and the disabled community to bring this to life. And there are so many reasons we love this design. First, it transfers the reliance from fine motor skills and hands to gross motor skills. It's flexible for different body types, abilities, and positions. It's snuggly for intimacy and comfort. And the middle section can be fit with toys for both male and female sex organs, allowing us to market to both genders with just one design. And we're not the only ones who are excited about this design. When we tested it last month with OTs and our disabled community, we heard things like the intimacy and comfort paired with pleasure vibration is genius. It will help me and so many others. And oh my God, I've never seen anything like it. This will totally change my life. Today, we're focusing on the biggest barrier, those with hand limitations, which makes up nearly 500 million people worldwide. But the larger disability market sits at over a billion, which Handy is well positioned to address and who are currently overlooked and frustrated with the growing sex tech sector. So this represents a huge investment opportunity because just 1% of the initial market represents over a billion dollars in revenue. And we've been busy making waves since our launch a year ago. We've got a community of over 5,000 disabled and clinical supporters. We've had over 700 registers of interest for the joystick. We've received a finalist position in the Assistive Tech Product of the Year in Australia. And we have a manufacturing and distribution partnership with Love Honey, one of the world's largest adult retailers and manufacturers globally. So if you wanna help millions of people like Andrew, and be on the ground floor of an untapped opportunity. We've recently opened a fundraising round. Please get in touch. We'd love to chat more. Thank you. So in terms of cleaning, we've considered the entire user journey from unboxing to use to cleaning to charging and storage to make it as hands-free accessible as, and as independent as possible. Um, that being said, we know that there are many levels of disability and that at the end of the day, some people may still need help. However, it's definitely been a consideration of ours to look at that entire user journey. Um, and yes, we've definitely tested it and happy to report that it works. Um, the design team, myself, occupational therapists, and 10 disabled people across Australia recently tested the prototypes that we created. And all of those amazing learnings have been fed back into the design process to strengthen the design of the handy joystick. In terms of costs, we're looking at roughly 300 Australian dollars retail price for the joystick itself, um, which will be covered under our National Disability Insurance Scheme, the NDIS, um, in Australia, which will then serve as a really amazing test pilot for us to be able to roll that out um, to other countries with similar insurance schemes. And that just means that the end cost isn't passed on to the end user. Thank you.